It's been a lively few weeks here on campus as candidates filled Sproul Plaza with flyers and posters for this year's ASCC election. Here's a recap of some of this year's candidates and party platforms. This year, five parties face each other in the election, along with several independent candidates. 25 candidates vie for the five executive positions and 78 candidates for the 20 senatorial seats. Though candidates maintain unique individual platforms, the respective parties are united by common goals. This year, um, our party's goals and our theme is how can Cal serve you and what, we would like, what, we'd, really, what we'd really like to accomplish is to work to make Cal more affordable, student-centered, diverse and equitable, and socially just. And th these, are, these are the platforms that we as a party collectively are running on and each and every one of our individual candidates' platforms reflect that. My party represents a larger subset of people. We attempt to represent every student, um, so we, you know, we look at every, the entire campus um, as a student body and so we really want to get everyone involved in the student government. We want the student government to benefit everyone. Um, so at the end of the day, it's every student, every year. Presidential candidate Noah Ikowitz and senatorial candidate David Douglas shared what they believe the campus and ASUC is lacking and what they hope to address if elected. In these elections and in this governance, the two major parties, College Service and Student Action, truly have almost no ideological differences. And by perpetuating that system, they make it so that their constituencies, in the end, are pitted against each other. And that's something that I don't think is good for the school, and I don't think is good for them. That this campus is not diverse, it's not integrated. We want integration on this campus. We're actually prepared to make a stand and really push the administration to integrate this campus and not segregate it through the privatization of the university. Students for Democratic University's party platform is to create a truly public university by fighting to reverse fee hikes, ridding student debt, and bringing back affirmative action. They value democracy and hope to grant students full participation in the ASUC decision-making process. Today is your last day to vote in the election. You can do so at any on-campus polling site or at election.asuc.org until midnight. The results will be announced next Thursday, April 19th. Reporting for CalTV, I'm Mia Sin.